put the dog in the picture, I am doing it first of all to raise awareness about the need for peace. For example, if you have a picture that has a dog in it and you look at a picture every day, and if in your mind the dove is a symbol for peace, it means that every morning when you look at that picture and you see the dove, the word peace goes through your mind. The word peace goes through your subconscious. Well, I paint for everybody. Because if you notice in my art, there is a white dove guy right there, you know? I think everybody on earth, no matter their background, no matter where they come from, no matter what they think, they can connect to the white dove. People in Peru, make peace in their lives. People in Alaska make peace in their lives. People in India, in China, in Africa. So I think that the message I have is a message that's for everybody. Sometimes I feel that there is a dove wherever I go, you know, <laughs> but of course I know that that's probably my imagination or probably that's what I would like to believe, you know, but more often than not, I see doves and I pay particular attention to them, you know, so now I understand different you know, I can recognize different dove sounds, you know, dove cries, you know, and uh, I like it. I like doves. Back in the day, I used to paint out of anger and out of frustration. But I realized you start by expressing what you feel. And as you get better, you develop the ability to use whatever media or medium you're working with to express a particular message. Because you see, I don't believe that art is something that does not have a direction. The better an artist gets, the more he can use his medium to see what he wants to see. There is a reason why I, I think that piece is, is very, very important. And that's why I try as much as possible to raise awareness about it. I have a daughter. My daughter is um, two years old, Euro, right now, with her mother, my ex-girlfriend. I think that it contributes because I think of the planet or the world that we're going to leave to them, you know, so it makes me want to try as much as possible to reach out with a message of peace, you know, because when I'm gone, she's going to be here. And if I can use art to make the world into a better place, to me, that is very, very important. At another level, the dove is a symbol for the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit has nine qualities, which I think are very, very important. Peace, of course, is one of them. So there is love, there is joy, there is peace, there is goodness, there is gentleness. All of them will go a long way to make this planet a better place if we thought about them every day and we try to leave them, you know? So that's why I put dove in every picture. My name is Aku. Aku Eyong. And Aku in the Bayangi language means rising. And my last name, Eyong, means voice. So my name is mean rising voice. Of course, when I was born, my parents gave me this name. They did not probably know, you know, what the voice was going to be about. But I believe that my art is the voice. And guess what? It's rising and it's going to keep on rising till I touch the sky. Yeah, I just got done doing a painting.